Good morning, John. I've been spending a lot of time going through the archives of the Vlogbrothers channels as we're doing our This Day in Vlogbrothers thing. Link in the description to that if you're curious what I'm talking about. But I noticed that the vast majority of Question Tuesday videos, they go to you, John. And while this makes a certain amount of sense because you make videos on Tuesdays, I think it's a little bit unfair. So today is Question Tuesday on a Friday. I ask people on YouTube and Facebook and Twitter to ask me hard questions. And here's the ones I got. Are you going to answer this question first? Joe, that was pretty easy. Actually, what is the new Republican health care plan all about? Well, this this is a hard one because there isn't a new Republican health care plan. They just want to keep all the good parts of Obamacare, but make it cost less by waving their hands around. But if you want to get a little bit less of a partisan hot take on this one, uh, healthcare triage has an amazing and in-depth video on this. Is flying to space the fastest way for Superman to fly? You know, I don't know too much about the physics of how Superman's supposed to work, so if, like, if air resistance is a really big deal for Superman, then maybe... But my feeling is that air resistance probably shouldn't matter to Superman too much. It's not like he's gonna get too hot. He seems pretty impervious. So probably no, it's like it's gonna take longer. Like the further your radius is, the longer your circumference is. That's that's how circles work. But I am not Superman's keeper. He can do it however he wants to do it. How do you properly pronounce thistle? You know, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know how to pronounce anything. Every time I get a little bit confused, I just open up this app, how Jay say. He's just a man who happens to have said like every word, so Thistle. What I mean, what do you want Jay to say? But, 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 but. Anglerfishes. Pooping. <laughs> Sorry, Jay. You're my whole world. Thank you for doing th that great work. When people come to VidCon, do they typically rent a car? I don't know if they do, but they shouldn't because parking in Los Angeles is terrible and so is driving. Get a cab to your hotel, you can probably walk to the convention center. If you need to, you can get an Uber anytime. How do you eat a pear without getting pear juice all up on your nose? Annalise, I'm a huge connoisseur of pears. I love them all. Sometimes I want to get it all over. Sometimes I want that. But if I don't, I get out a nice sharp knife and I just swoop right down and I make a little square of the core and then I'm like nibble on the core. And then just into strips and eat them and oh, it's so good and mess-free. You have to clean the knife and also maybe your plate that you put them on. But it's such a wonderful ritual way to spend time. The feeling of the knife going through, just like ooh, through that soft, soft part. Like, yeah. I may get too excited about pears. I just realized that for the first time. Would Bernie have one? For this question, let's have a guitar. Well, I don't know and nobody else does it. If you think that you're sure, then you're wrong. It's too easy to be certain of things that can be proven. So when you feel that way, sing this song. How's Dave? Well, if you're talking about the fish, Dave is, is less, less good. He could barely hold up his own string, but he's still floating. How many cats is too many cats? Well, according to my cat, Two cats would be too many cats, which is terrible for me because my actual answer is like maybe eight? I like cats and pears. Cat pineapple, apple pear. <laughs> is the S or the C silent in scent? Oh, that's weird. Because scent and scent and scent are all words. All right, I looked it up. Uh, the online etymology dictionary says that the C and to scent was added in the 17th century because people felt like it. So it's the C, I think, that's silent. Can this be the last question? Yes. I have here with me Additionally, a bunch of the prints that Claire Emery made for us to celebrate our 10th year anniversary on YouTube. Hello, Llama! Yeah! I got uh, Claire to loan me this so that I could show it off. This is the actual wood block that is put into the press. Uh, and these actually degenerate as they are used, and so there's only a certain amount before they lose their crispness and you just can't use them anymore. So when you do wood blocks, it's, a, it's definitionally a limited run. I love them. They smell good. I didn't know that they would smell good. But that's the thing. I'm, I just wanted to show you me holding them in real life so that you could see the, the paper and what it looks like and how big they are and stuff. There's a link in the description if you're interested in these. Thanks for all your questions, and John, I'll see you on Tuesday.